Hello everyone and welcome to uh, Kahoot game and in this one I'm gonna show you how you can uh, play this game and um, and set it up for yourself. You can either click on the link that we'll send you or you can do it alongside this video. If you click on the link that we send you, you're gonna go to kahoot.it and enter a game pin. Right now the game pin is this number right here but that game pin changes all the time so you might get another number. I'm gonna put that number in here Three, two, six, and then what was the rest? Nine, nine, one, five. Nine, nine, one, five. And then press enter. And then, friends, you can pick any nickname that you want. I'm gonna put my own name in here, Mr. Jengis. And when I do that, I click on OK Go, and it tells me that I am in. That means everything is going great. Oh, let me see. Yes, right here. Tells me that I am in and everything, that means everything is going good. Now in here, I'll see my name. That means I can start competing and everybody's name can be populated in here. All right, are you ready, friends? Actually, let me put that number in here. Are you ready, friends, to get a Kahoot started? All right, I'm in and I'm gonna click on start. Okay, this is technology trivia. The first questions are gonna be about hardware and software. Can you all say hardware? And can you all say software? Yes, computers are made of hardware and software. Hardware are all the things that we can touch. Like a keyboard, you can touch keyboard, yeah. Uh, we can also touch a laptop, that's hardware. You can touch it. And even the mouse, I'm not talking about the animal, I'm talking about this mouse right here, that is hardware as well. Everything that we can touch about a computer is hardware. Everything that we can't touch, that is inside our computers, those are called software. Things such as YouTube, or Google, you know, the things that are inside the computer but you can't really touch them. All right, let's see the first question. The first question. Computers are made of hardware and software. Which one is a computer? So if you think it's the red one, click the red. Is it the yellow? Or is it the blue? Or is it the green? Which one's a computer? Is the red one a computer? Is the blue one a computer? Or is it the yellow one that's a computer? Yeah. Or is it the green one? Is that a computer? Go ahead and select the correct answer, the answer that you think is correct. Yes! The correct answer was the red choice. All right. Hardware is any part of the computer that we can physically touch. Is this keyboard hardware? Red means no, blue means yes. Yes, this keyboard. Is it hardware? Can we touch it? Red means no, blue means yes. This keyboard. Can we touch it? Red means no, and blue means yes. Great job. Next question. And hardware can come in many shapes and sizes. Is this laptop hardware? Can you physically touch it? Red means no, blue means yes. Yes, the laptop is hardware. You can touch it, you can feel it. That's why it is hardware. Boom, and I am on fire, friends. Okay. What app is this? What app is this? Red is YouTube. Blue is Elmo. Yellow is Google. And green is computer. Which one is the correct answer? What app is this? What app is this? Red, is it YouTube? Is it blue, Elmo? 
Is it yellow Google? Or is it the green computer? The correct answer was YouTube. Hardware is any part of the computer that you can physically touch. Then, is YouTube hardware? Can you touch YouTube? Red means no, blue means yes. No, we can't touch YouTube. YouTube lives inside the hardware and it's called software. Okay, let's talk about software. Software are the programs that are inside your computer. There are the apps or the games or the videos or the photos that you see inside an iPad or a computer. All those things are called software. Can you guys say software? Good. Okay. Let's get into it. Software are the programs inside the computer. Which one is software? Is it the red? Is that software? Is it the blue? Is that software? Is it the yellow? Or is it the green? Yes, Chrome is software. Really nice. Okay, software are the programs inside the computer. Yes. Which one is software? Is it red? Scratch Junior? Is it blue? A computer? Is it yellow? A taco? Or is it green? a game controller. Which one is a program that's inside the computer? We can play around with it, we can do stuff with it, but we can't really touch it. Which one is it? Is a software that we can't really touch? Yes! Scratch Junior is software. Alright, congratulations, you've made it to round two. This round will be about the internet. What are some things we can do on the internet? We can play video games. Yeah, we can play video games on the internet. We can watch YouTube videos. Yes, we can watch YouTube videos. Can we order food on the internet? Yes, we can go shopping and order food. And we can even go to school on the internet. Yes, a lot of people are going on Zoom and going to school on the internet. So let's see the first question about the internet. Is everything found on the internet true? Everything found in the internet is true. Red means no, blue means yes. And friends, I do have a dinosaur here using a computer. And this dinosaur says everything found in the internet is true. Is this dinosaur telling the truth? Yes for blue, no for red. No, everything found in the internet is not true. Some of it is not true. Everything found in the internet is true, says this dinosaur. But can dinosaurs even use the internet? Can dinosaurs use a computer? Did dinosaurs have internet? I don't think so. I don't think this is true. What is a way of sending a message from one computer to another. What is a way of sending messages from one computer to another? Can you send messages to a computer with a telephone? Can you do it with a telephone? Or can you do it with an email? Red is telephone, blue is email. Red is telephone, and then blue is email. Yes, email is the correct answer. Okay, okay. We can use the internet without any wires or cables. Wireless internet is also called what? Red says Wajai. Hmm. Blue is Fi Fi. Yellow is Wi Fi. And green is Hi Hi. Which one is wireless internet? Maybe you heard of a grown-up saying, Oh no, the internet is gone. What word do they use when they say, when they refer to the internet? Wireless internet is called Wajai for red. Fi-Fi. 
Wi-Fi or Hi Hi? That's right, Wi-Fi is the correct answer. Yes, you might have heard of a grown-up say, hey, the Wi-Fi is out again. Or your teacher might have said that, the Wi-Fi is gone. And without Wi-Fi, there is no internet. Yes, guys, Wi-Fi is another word that we use for wireless internet. Okay, we use browsers to get on the internet. Yes, we use these programs, this software called browsers. Which one is an internet browser? So we can find all of the browsers right here. There's Chrome, there's Edge, there's Mozilla Firefox, there's Opera, and there's Safari. Which one of these is the internet browser? Is Scratch Junior the internet browser? Is Facebook? internet browser? Is Chrome internet browser? Or is it YouTube that is an internet browser? Yes, Chrome is the correct answer. Oh wow, I'm making a lot of points. Okay, in this one you can select all of them. You can select any choice that you want as long as you think it is true. The internet is an amazing place where we can do many things. What can we do in the internet? What can we do in the internet? Can we play games on the internet? If you think so, then select the red. Blue says watch videos. Can we watch videos in the internet? If you think so, then press the blue. Can you talk to friends on the internet? If you think you can talk to friends on the internet, press the yellow too. And can you go to school on the internet? Hmm, it might be possible. If you think you can go to school on the internet, select the green as well. After that friends, click on the little submit button below your choices. And that looks like this. Boom boom. I don't know if you can see that, but there's a little submit button down there. There's a little submit button down here, and I'm gonna press on that. There's a little submit button down here. Uh -huh. Yes! That's right. Yes, all of those things were correct. You can play games on the internet. You can totally do that. You can watch videos on the internet, yes. You can talk to friends. Mm -hmm. And you can go to school on the internet. And a lot of people even do that these days. Okay, all right. Congratulations, everyone. You've made it to round three. This round will be about robots. Robots are machines that can be programmed to do things on their own. They can do stuff for us. What are some things that a robot can be programmed to do? If you had a robot, what would you tell your robot to do? Maybe clean your room? Maybe find you candy? Maybe find you stuff? Yeah, and robots can even make other machines for you, they can fix things for you, or they can repair, or they can make things for you. Okay? Which robot is this? This is a robot right here in the middle. You see the photo of it? Is it an autonomous car? Red is autonomous car. Blue is robot seal. Red is autonomous car. Blue is robot seal. Which one is this robot? Yes, autonomous car is the correct answer. And who's driving this car? Can you guys see a driver? Nope. There are no drivers inside this car. So, in an autonomous car, you could be going to sleep and you can be going to places at the same time. Pretty cool. Alright, which robot is this? Yes, is this? An autonomous car? Is this an autonomous car? Or is it a robot seal? Is this robot here? Is it an autonomous car? That's red. Or is it a robot seal? And that's blue. Red for autonomous car. Blue for robot seal. That's right. This is a robot seal. And it has really cute two cameras for eyes. And it's, it's really cute, right? Yeah. So robots can be cute too. Which robot is this? Hmm. Is this 
Mars rover? Is this a Mars rover? Or is this a robotic arm? Red is Mars rover. Blue is robotic arm. Which one is it? That's right. This is a robotic arm. It can build cars. It can build desks. It can build many kinds of things. It can even build other robots. Yes. All right. Which robot is this? Which robot is this? Is this a Mars rover? Or is it a robotic arm? Hmm. Is it a Mars rover? Or is it a robotic arm? That's right. That is a Mars rover. And it goes to different planets for us. All right, friends. Last question. Last, last question. Uh, which one is a robot? We have red, blue, yellow, or green. Which one of those is a robot? Is the red one a robot? Is the blue one? Or is the yellow one a robot? Or is the green one? A robot yes this is a tiny tiny robot friends called spot can you all say spot yes and spot is this really cute dog that kind of looks like um, a dog I would say so let's see what spot can do Perfect. Okay, everyone, that is it for this Kahoot. What did you think about that robot? That was a really, really cool robot that can walk around and do things and it kind of looks like a dog. What would you program Spot to do for you? So I want you guys to think about that. All right, friends, that's all I have for you today. My name is Mr. Jengis and I'm here with Code Speak Labs. Everyone, you can find the link to this Kahoot if you want to do it on your own in the description to this video. And please like and subscribe to our channel if you want to see more videos like this. Bye-bye. Oh, wow. I'm here. Mm -hmm.